Hi guys, here in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can add a country flag into your language selector in Shopify store. Here in this Shopify store, you can see on the top, I have this language selector. So I am displaying country flags. For example, I am clicking on it on this drop down and here you can see that we have uh, American flag as well as Israel flag. So if I'm selecting American, then it uh, comes out that uh, we have English language and if we are selecting israeli then hebrew language is selected all right so let me show you how you can do it yourself just copy and pasting the code for free i am going to delete everything and then uh, give you a hint like how you can do it yourself So I am here in the dashboard here you can see that I have installed down theme if you have any other theme then you can also uh, make it work uh, because this is really easy just copy and pasting the code just click, click on these three dots click on edit code and here you should uh, uh, find the snippets click on it click on add a new snippet and write here the name I have already written a blog post you can follow this so create a new snippet and name of that snippet will be language country dash flag language dash country dash flag and you should paste it right here click on done and then you should paste the code which is this one just copy this complete code and then paste it right here and then you can click on save and now you should uh, upload the country flags SVG images in assets. So actually I have already uh, uploaded those SVG images which is uh, if you are scrolling in the assets go to the assets and here you will see like I have IL.SVG so this is for Israel like uh, Hebrew and we have US.SVG that is for America. So you can go to internet and search here country flags SVG so actually uh, uh, why I'm using SVG because this is very much uh, compact this has small size and you can actually download it from here we have multiple countries here you can download it and then uh, upload here in assets how you can upload it like click on add new asset and click on uh, this add file and it will automatically upload so that's how I upload it and now I am importing here in this code so one more condition is like for example you have any other country to mention then you should mention here the country code for example I have uh, Hebrew for Israel so I am using IL uh, for US I am using US and uh, I am putting here the condition with IL we have us country code so if you have any other country you can actually use your country codes and accordingly that drop down will reflect here so let me refresh back you can see that we don't have any country flag because we have not imported yet so we need to go to navigation so here we have navigation dash main dot liquid so this is for the header navigation scroll it down and here you will find 399 line number which is this one so i'm importing here why because this is the cart icon here just right side of this cart icon i'm interested to put this so that's why i selected this place all right so how we can import you can copy this import statement also from here and paste it right here all right then click on save and once changes are saved then you, you can refresh it back and here we go now you can see that we have country flag if you are selecting any different country for example in this case we have us so english version is displaying and if i am selecting israeli flag which is for hebrew language so that's how you can actually uh, solve this problem if you are facing any issue in that you can ask me i will definitely help you out in that so thank you so much for watching this video. If you are new on this channel, then please subscribe this channel. Also like this video. Thank you once again. See you in the next video.